Oh, there he is. Come on up here, young man. I want to start, first of all, with Cody. Because, Cody, you were in a capitated family practice environment, right? Do we have some uh, mics for these guys? Can we mic these guys up? We're mic'd up. Oh, yeah. you guys are awesome, man. Yeah. You, are you guys, wow, these guys they are, awesome. They, they are awesome. awesome. Okay, question number one for Cody. Hey, Cody. You're in a managed care practice. You're making a good income. First of all, why did you leave? And then once you guys both decided to leave that capitated practice, you decided, okay, I'm going to buy this technology. First it was Cyton, yeah. and then in mode. How much did you rely on a feeder system? And how did you let your capitated patients know, hey, I'm over here, come and see me. How did you do that? Yeah, so <clears throat> as a family practice physician, I that was never destined to be a family practice physician. How's that? I did it because it was a short residency that would get me to the point, this is the honest truth, that would get me to a point to be able to do cosmetics. Right, that was kind of where we were thinking that this would go. Um, but with that said, you get comfortable in the residency position that you're in, so you start working and, and doing it so you can make some money doing it, because that's what you're trained to do. Now, um, follow-up question on what was the... Yeah, so the, you had this a feeder system, you had some patients, and you didn't do a yeah. lot of expensive advertising. So How did you get them over to your skin worthy? Yeah, sorry. The, this is where this, this is the big fail, right? Because you get lured into this primary care model where you don't like ever ask patients for money ever. And by that, you don't market to them ever because that might annoy them. So this was a big fail. I didn't lean on the family practice uh, database that I had. And in hindsight, let's just, okay, if you have 2,000 patients in your family practice and call that 2,000 emails, even if you only had, I don't know, a 5% interest out of those 2,000 people, it's still, what's that, 100 people? So take home message number one. If you've got a database, you do don't, don't waste it. Don't waste it. 